Hello, my name is Cherie. Welcome to today's video, which is about Rituals Shower Foaming Gels, which have been very luxurious in the shower. I've tried to update all of my, you know, skincare routines to kind of investigate which other products are out there to add into the collection which I will be using for everyday use. So this is a video which is hopefully helpful for you and um, I'm going to review some products from Rituals so let's get into the products. Rituals is a holistic brand which focuses on making a ritual or routine for waking up, going to bed, day-to-day -day life because life sometimes gets a bit too busy, right? And we're too focused on, you know, knowing that we need to do other things and not able to do the finer things, the finer details in life like relaxation, self-care, our hobbies that we like to do. And sometimes, and a lot of the times, rituals can kind of fill in that gap depending on what you like. So my time type of self-care routine I'm trying to build in some type of spa experience because not every day I can go to the spa and enjoy 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 a spa experience and I like rituals fragrances it reminds me of a spa uh, amongst other products I've used before so I thought that I would give rituals a try and see how some of the products can fit into my daily self-care routine which is just having a shower at this point okay nothing special just having a shower okay but sometimes when you're in the shower you want something of that little extra you want that little you know pizzazz that little spa quality the fragrances when you open the shower door you want the whole house to know that you've had spa experience okay that you've had one so rituals can grant you that you know rituals can grant you that you know just give it a little try. Well, no, not really. I'm here to do the review. So let's get into it. I've tried rituals before when I used to use a birch box and I had a small sample in there to use and I absolutely loved the smell. At that point, I never thought to kind of investigate the brand and now I'm trying to, you know, upgrade some of my brands, some of my products in my self-care routine. I thought it was perfect to give rituals a try again. The first product is the Ritual of Karma um, and the smell of this is, well the fragrance should I say, is Holy Lotus and Organic White Tea. This fragrance is not really strong but it gives a nice kind of spa experience. It's slightly floral in scent but not over powerful bearing it and it's really nice, it's really nice. You only need a small amount. It comes out like a like a foamy gel and you when it when you when you mix it in with the water it is it really brings out the smell and I, what I like about this the most is the lather the lava is really good I get a really good lather out it I get a really good scrub when I'm using my exfoliating glove which I really like and that just helps with the shower experience that's what you want um so that is not when I rub it into my hand yeah you can really smell the the fragrance then it's very mild like I said and but it's very florally at the same time but it's very mild like it almost reminds me of babies a little bit and you know yeah reminds me of babies so that's 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 number one the thing is with the all of these shower foaming gels they all do practically the same thing but they all have different rituals different um collections to go with it some might have some teas some might have some um hand masks that you can rub on your hand and smell as you're going to sleep to help you to relax and also moisturize your hands so there's different you know amenities with the within the collection but at this moment i just thought i would just review the shower gels they're all practically the same we all do kind of the same type of moisturizing but it's like the feel and the mood is what I feel the shower gels are going for that giving you that fragrance that you know type of spa like feeling the next one is the ritual of, of the ritual of ham and again this one oh, When I was first in the shop and the lady said, I really like this one and she liked the Ritual of Ham and I was like, 
putting on my hand I'm thinking mm, I don't know if I like it because it reminds me of where my mum used to go to the sauna back in the day and she used to always go with her essential oils and just throw them in the, <laughs> in the steam room and I'm like mum can you actually do that and she was like yeah but I think because most of the people in there were Caribbean anyway and everyone's going to spell you know put their fragrance everywhere and it reminds me of that but this is a eucalyptus and rosemary and I absolutely love it. When I was in the shower, I was like, oh my goodness, I feel like I'm in a Moroccan spa without the Morocco and without the spa because I'm at home. It was just so nice, so refreshing and so uplifting, but it's kind of relaxing like I'm going to bed. It was just, it's like, it's a fresh scent. The eucalyptus it's very strong in this but it's not over powerful or overbearing and I feel like it feels like the sea like I'm by the sea I've had a fresh shower after coming out of the sea and this is what I smell nice calmness coming into my life and what I also like about the rituals on the products they have like a small little you know put a purifying ceremony for the body and soul it has like a little quote which i feel like is really cute and really nice because it kind of sums up the collection though i haven't tried the full collections i've probably tried like mostly tried that the shower gels and mostly the exfoliants but one day i will hopefully try the whole collection when i'm ready but yeah i absolutely love this smell love it 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 the next one is Samurai Yuzo Shower. This is a Mandarin and Yuzo. Don't know what the smell of Yuzo is. I thought when I first picked up, picked up this product, it was a man's product, but I like to kind of use men's products every now and again, depending on what it was or what it is. And the shop assistant said, it's not, it's not, it's just unisex or it's just the color of the brand, um, the collection. This one is very fused, fruity, smells like Mandarin. So it gives you that, kind of energizing type fragrance not over powerful again but it really smells nice when you're in the shower good foaming they all have good foaming and good lathers which is really good and i really enjoy it and you can these are also two in one so you can use them as shaving gels as well so if you've got them on your body and you've lathered up you can use your razor on your legs and or your bikini line and actually shave which is good so if you're out and about you've got it in your gym bag or you've got it in the spa or you've got it wherever you go practice training or your friend's house and you haven't brought one or the other maybe you probably need a shaver as well then it's actually good for that as well um i like it it's really nice and um, when i've used these products my skin doesn't feel overly dry i don't have eczema or any dermatitis or any skin conditions on my skin so i'm not sure how it will be dealing with how it will work with people who have eczema or any other dermatitis or anything like that because the, the fragrance might irritate the skin so i'm not too sure about that so you would have to kind of sample it they don't really have any instructions on here regarding anything about it being sensitive. Um, no, not that I can read, not that I can see. But they do have a collection that is for sensitive skin that doesn't have um, as many fragrances in them. So I haven't got that product with me today and I didn't, I didn't think of buying it at that time because I'm all about the fragrance and the smells in my chores. When I walk into the shop, it just feels like I'm going into a spa. It's just lovely. I just like it when shops, when you walk into them, they give you that shop experience of whatever you're supposed to buy. Like you've gone into rituals, you're going to buy skincare products and it just smells like a spa. So you know the experience that you're hopefully trying to get from the products, you know? Like going into Stravados. I love going into Stravados. They have their own smell, you know, and I love it. I'm hoping, I hope my clothes smell like this even though I'm going to wash them anyway but still I like that whole shopping experience and I've realized that Ikea has been doing that as well each time I go to a different area it's a different smell relating me to that area I love that marketing like that gets me you know that really gets me you know I'm sometimes I'm hoping that I've left my purse at home because I do that quite a lot but anyway I digress the other shower form is the Ritual of Sakura, which is a organic rice milk and cherry blossom. Um, these are all, the smaller sizes are all travel sizes, so you can use it when you're going on, you know, traveling around. And then obviously the larger sizes is what you normally have at home. So that's quite good. This one, smell, and I don't tend to use this one too much. Yeah, cherry blossoms, not very fruity, not very fruity, more of a florally type smell, but 
yeah, smells, smells quite relaxing, quite, you know, like I'm going to have a nice summer day, like I'm going to go somewhere. Um, but again, the all of the shower gels do this, the similar type thing with the, you know, the, the feel on the body, the foaming as well. Like I said, I don't feel very dry when I've used these products. And normally, anyway, I, as soon as I've had my shower on damp skin, I apply my lotions on top. The other last product that I want to tell you about is... Uh, a skincare product. I wasn't supposed to buy a skincare product when I went to Ritual Shop. I was only supposed to buy some shower gels and to have a look at what was in the store because there was a new store opening in Trapper Centre. And since I've been on my skincare routine and I've got a lot of products that I'm still trying to go through, I thought, you know what, I don't have a manual exfoliator. And the woman in the shop, I told her about, you know, my skincare and she's like, oh, why don't you give this a try? And, you know, it's got some rice, um, rice in, fine rice in there as, it's, are you using, as you're using it as an exfoliator and it gives you a nice fresh feeling and I thought, okay, then you don't have to say much to let me get me to the, buy the product. But it's only 75 mils and it was about, I think, I've it's like either nine pounds actually it's, I think it's 12 pounds 95 which I feel like is it's I feel is expensive for a small product but I thought I'll oh, give it give it a try and I really liked it I really liked the smell I really liked the sensation on the skin the molecules in there or the exfoliating agent in there was it very fine the rice and I felt like it wasn't too you know it wasn't too rough but it wasn't did it also feel like it wasn't doing anything at all which I really liked I loved this I love the smell I think it's just rituals they just get me by the smell the smell of the spa experience and when I use it on the skin it feels very fresh when I've you know washed it off ready to start my uh, mask routine which I really like I'm actually using a chemical exfoliator at the or exfoliator at the moment which I like I'm not really clued up yet of, about all the skin products and stuff like that only with the me basics so i the the skin chemical peeling and it's fully I'm, I'm not too sure about that just yet because i do see a difference but i couldn't really say the actual difference at the time when i have the product on but when i actually use a manual exfoliator you can feel the difference you can feel the freshness on your skin you can feel that's obviously doing something because of the manual stimulation i've tried many manual exfoliators before on my skin I've tried Origins Exfoliator before, the Modern Friction, and I did not like it. I wanted to like it so much because I liked the application, I liked the manual stimulation on the skin, but it was just burning my skin. It was literally burning my skin, and I don't have sensitive skin, and I was just wondering, is that how it's supposed to feel, or what? And she was like, no, you need to stop using it, and I was like, mm, okay. So, and I really liked that because it really gave a good, you know, nice fresh new skin and I felt so fresh with it but with that it's highly fragrance and I know with the skincare products on your face it's not supposed to be highly fragrant so you know that's good that I actually ditched that so this one the rituals of now day the natural skincare purifier skin brightening face exfoliator morango and bamboo I really really like and I'm not too sure if I actually will keep it in my skincare regimen because of the price and but I guess I, I'm on a new journey of Project Junkinism. Project Junkinism? Yeah, I'm on a new journey. So who knows if this will stay in my actual stash or be converted to something else. But at the meantime, I'm really enjoying this product. So that's all the products that I'm reviewing today. The Rituals Shower Forming Gel and the Exfoliator, which both products I really love because they bring that spa experience at home, which is my goal for my self-care routine. They are a bit more on the pricier side. Some stores have some outlets, like in Cheshire Oaks, they have an outlet store in Rituals, which you can actually get some of the small travel sizes for four of these for £10, and you can mix and match. They have shower gels, they have exfoliators, exfoliators and they have body creams as well which I think is really good so you can kind of try it out which type of product that you want to have if you want to bring that into your normal product stash so that's a really good way to kind of try out a few things and yes 
that is that is the video that is the video i'm all done the only thing that i add to my spa experience is adding essential oils into my mister which you know helps me to bring that spa experience into my bedroom okay and i love that it's really cheap it's really efficient you drop in a few essential oils give them a smell put that all up in there and there you got it voila